Hello guys, welcome to my new Changing Impact video. Guys, in this video, we are going to talk about the new Pyro DPS character, Alechinos. Alechinos top 5 4 star weapon. Guys, if you think that we don't have a good 4 star weapon for Alechino, watch till watch this video till the end i'm gonna talk about every each and every weapon not only the five weapon i'm gonna talk about in total of seven to eight weapons that are gonna be very good on our lichino and of course we're gonna pick our top five our top five from the seven to eight options so stay tuned till the end guys okay before talking about the uh, weapons i just quickly want to tell you guys that Arlechino is a pyro DPS character based on the attack percentage and HP percentage. Her kit is a little similar to what Hutao does. More the HP, more the damage and lesser she has HP on the field. The multipliers goes on and on. And she's also based on the charge attack, normal attacks and ult is kind of similar to what Hutao does. So that's what Arlechino does and do on the field so now let's talk about the weapon number five oh yeah this weapon's gonna be the newest weapon in the game newest four star weapon in the game it's called the dialogues of the desert sages as i already told you guys that uh Alecino is based on the hp percentage and the attack percentage so this is the only weapon here not the only weapon my bad but this is the weapon here with the hp percentage and one more thing guys this weapon is free like if you played 4.5 patch they gave it for free it's an event exclusive weapon you can claim that weapon after completing a certain part of the event in the patch 4.5 so if you don't have this weapon right now in your game in your inventory you're never gonna own this weapon in the future because it's an event exclusive weapon that event is gone so the weapon so the on number five we have the dialogue of the desert sages in the base attack this one gives 510 base attack and in the hp percentage this will give you 41% HP that will gonna be benefit for like all the HP character. This weapon can be usable on the Sha uh, on the Zhongli. This weapon is gonna be very very good for the Zhongli. Before this weapon, will uh, some players use a three star HP percentage weapon on Zhongli. But after coming this weapon, this weapon is gonna be very very good. I already have created a video on this. I already told you guys to farm for this weapon. This one is gonna be. A very good weapon for Alechino. In the refinement, this weapon will just give you a little 16 energy and every time the character got healed. And you can trigger this every 10 seconds. And you can even trigger this when you are not on the field. But that's not that's not gonna happen with Alechino. But this weapon is gonna be very very good. I include it in the top five only because this weapon is free weapon, literally a free weapon, and this weapon is giving you a tons of attack and 41.3% HP. That is huge. Along with that, you'll also getting the energies, guys. So on number five, we have the dialogues of the desert sages. Alright, guys. On number four, from now on, guys, from four, three, two, one, all these weapons are my favorite weapons in the game and i think the most used weapon in this game some of them are still free and some of them are not free you have to buy the battle pass or you have to spend the money so on number four guys one of my favorite weapon that is the dragon's bane dragon's bane is the i think four star signature weapon for huta from ages like if you ha don't have this the staff of Woma, many will suggest you use the R5 Dragon's Bane on Huta and it will go very close to what staff of Woma does on Huta. I don't know that's gonna be case for Alechino or not, but guys, this is gonna be strong. Like, the kit is so similar. Both are the Pyro character, both are the Polam character. If this weapon works on the Huta, I think definitely this weapon is gonna be working on Alechino. I I know something is different with Alechino's kit, but the working is almost the same in the end. This will give you five, 454 base attack and 2 to 1 elemental mastery. That is very high elemental mastery. And pyro connectors are purely based on the elemental uh, reaction, the wave reaction. So I think this was gonna be blast. And also in the refinement. This one is giving you extra 36% pyro damage bonus. So that is also going to be very, very insane. So guys, if you have this weapon R5, you must try this weapon on Alechino. 
your RH, you know, will give amazing, amazing damage. Like if I switch this to my Hu Tao, my elemental mastery goes up to 304, but my crit damage goes to 165. Still, my crit damage drop drops a massive amount. You can see here from 231 to literally 165. Still, guys, you can see the videos I have uploaded on my channel comparing these both weapons. Still, Dragon's Bane gives a very tough competition to Star of Woma, be Star of Woma being a 5 star weapon and Dragon's Bane being a 4 star weapon in, in the game since the ages. So, guys, this one is literally very, very strong. So, on number 4, guys, we have the uh, Dragon's Bane. This polearm, this missive wind spell, is also a free polearm. Uh, one of the exclusive weapon rewards if you don't again if you don't have this weapon in your inventory you are never gonna own this weapon in the future it's gone gone forever but guys it's a free weapon if you are playing uh, Jinxin for a long time since the Sumeru's first update you probably already have this weapon in your inventory this one is very very good in terms of giving only attack percentage this weapon is amazing trust me guys this weapon gives you giving you 41.3 percent attack and along with that giving you 500 and base attack in the refinement also this weapon giving you 24 percent attack whenever you trigger the reaction every 10 second and guys this will also giving you 96 elemental mastery i already told you how important is elemental mastery when i'm explaining about the dragon's bane this weapon is giving you tons of tons of base attack and attack percentage and along with that giving you 96 elemental mastery I am pretty sure this weapon is gonna be a blast on Arlet Shino I am very very excited to test this this weapon on my Arlet Shino So guys on number 3 we have the Missive Wins for one of my favorite weapons Okay enough talking about the non crit rate or crit damage weapons now comes with the top 2 you, you may already know about these weapons on number 2 we have the black cliff pole yes guys we have the black cliff pole it's the shop weapon you have to spend your wishes in order to get this weapon you have to buy this weapon from the shop I have this weapon R5 because I've been playing this game since the launch so i managed to get this weapon on r5 and i have one more black cliff pole in my inventory i don't know why this is giving you 55 crit damage and 500 and base attack yes guys a four star weapon with the crit damage but it's not a free weapon you have to spend your wishes or the money in order to get this weapon so it it kind of a pay to win weapon but a four star weapon in refinement also this weapon giving you attack after defeating an enemy, attack skills increase by 24% for 30 seconds. This can be stacked up to maximum 3. And guys, uh, Alechino is an AoE uh, based character. So if the bunch of 4 to, f uh, three, four to 5 enemies come and one of them is killed in between, so immediately Alechino will gain extra 4% attack and you can gain that attack and deals more damage to the remaining enemies. And guys, this weapon is also giving you 55% crit damage for a 4 star weapon. This is one of the highest crit damage in the game, close to being a 5 star weapon. So again guys, on number 2, Black Cliff Pole. Without doubt, this weapon is very very strong. I have used this weapon on all the great DPS 5 star weapon like Uta and the Shao. This weapon is amazing, a blast, blast weapon like you should try this weapon on these characters and I think this weapon is also going to be very very strong on Arlechino so if you want to spend money and if you already have this weapon in your inventory so you don't have to worry about any other 4 star weapon the next steps only going to be the 5 star weapon if you want to have more damage with your Arlechino but otherwise this is one of the greatest 4 star weapon in this game Hey right, guys on number 1 I think you already know but before talking about the number one, I want to mention some bonus weapons. There are two to three more weapons in this game that are going to be very, very good on your Arleshino. So let's uh, talk about those. Uh, first weapon, the first bonus weapon is the rightful reward. 
rightful reward i don't know what is this woman is if it's a craftable weapon i think it's a craftable pola ma for a uh, fountain craftable weapon i think it's a phone fountain craftable weapon rightful reward in the base attack this is giving you 565 base attack and I, this weapon is actually giving you hp percentage 27.6% hp percentage and when the wielder is healed in the refinement restore 8 energy this way can be triggered once every 10 second and can occur even when the character is not on the field i don't think this weapon uh, i don't know uh, how good is this this weapon going to be on the alechino but it matches with the kit alechino heals himself and alechino can get the refinement ability uh, of like the fullest and uh, this weapon also giving you very good amount of base attack like 565 is very high for for a four shot uh, weapon and also giving you 27.6% hp so let's see uh I, what i told you just uh, in the top 5 uh, weapons you don't have any weapon from my top 5 list so and you also don't want to spend money or any wishes on the weapon so you can craft this weapon this is a fountain craftable weapon i think rightful reward and you can get a uh, a good strat and you can actually enjoy your alechino without spending any money on the weapon so first bonus weapon is the rightful reward Hey right, guys next bonus weapon is another B barrel pass weapon that is the ballad of the forge uh, i don't know this weapon is good or not but this weapon giving you 510 base attack here here and giving you 27.6% crit damage higher than what you will get with, uh, not higher uh, sorry lesser than what you get with the death match that's another uh, by a forge weapon from the bp very old very famous but the problem with is the element refinement ability the refinement ability is very situational you have to play at least three different elemental types in your party in order to gain 120 elemental mastery see getting 120 elemental mastery is good but you are getting lesser critted here you getting only 7.6% critted but this critted is higher than her signature weapon her signature weapon actually provide a lesser crit rate comparing to this but with a higher base attack and a better better refinement ability but <laughs> this weapon is giving you higher crit rate but i don't know about the refinement ability that's why i didn't include this weapon in the top 5 list but i think if you can work according to the uh, refinement ability like you can include the three different elemental type you can actually gain the 120 elemental mastery and 120 elemental mastery is going to be actually good because definitely she is going to deal the elemental reaction damage So first weapon first bonus weapon is the rightful rewards and second is the ballad of the forge I think these two bonus weapons are also good but very situational and I don't know if they are going to be good on Alechino or not So now move on to the our number one weapon for the Alechino I think you already know guys it's very old weapon it's very famous weapon and it's our only hope in back time that if I we want a good four star uh, uh dps weapon we have to buy the bp and use this weapon in the old times it's the that match guys that match is very famous old weapon the only problem that match has that match has very less base attack like 5 450 or base attack is very less so you have to you know buy the refinements some will say that on r1 this weapon is very bad it gives you very lesser attack so you have to go with the r2 r3 but yeah this weapon is the god for sharp pola weapon this weapon can make any dps character a very good dps character very very strong this weapon is giving you 36.8% critted the highest critted in the game for a pola if there is a uh, four four star character the highest is with the staff of the scarlet set in the all pola category but i actually talk him bahut hi four stars weapon if there are at least two opponents nearby attack is increased by 16% and also defense is increased by 16% if there are fewer uh, than two opponent nearby attack is increased by 24% uh, that means if you are uh, fighting with the crowd this weapon will be giving you 16% uh, attack and if you are fighting with only one enemy single enemy this weapon will give you 24% extra uh, attack percentage So guys this weapon is literally very strong and if you have this weapon you even don't have to go for the signature weapon but yes the attack problem is there with the death patch but you can solve that problem with the refinement 
Yes, guys. On number one, we have the death match. So I have talked about like I've talked seven weapons in this video. I told you guys seven total weapons in this video, and they all are good. My top five, I already told you with the two bonus weapons. You can try by yourself, and I'm gonna try for you guys the all the weapons I own. Only the bonus weapons is I don't own the bonus weapons. Is besides that, I own all the top five weapons. So I'm gonna make a separate video. And let you know, guys, that which weapon is good. But according to me, I think the, you know, ranking I give, yeah, I think that's gonna be the same after making the video. So guys, that's it for the video. I talked a lot. These are my top five weapons. These are gonna be a very good on Alechino. Alechino is looking super, super insane. Uh, I'm very excited for Alechino. I think you are also. So I'm gonna get Alechino. When I'm gonna get the Alechino, I'll try. I'm gonna try all this stuff and all this stuff. So that's it for the video, guys. If you like the video, you can hit the like button. Subscribe, guys. Come on, subscribe to my channel for more amazing, interesting, daily reviews in the future. We'll meet in the next video, guys. Till then, bye bye. Take care.